So it's February, and Minecraft 1.21 is still looking a bit lackluster. So, is it time to start panicking for Minecraft 1.21? Well, we're gonna go over that in today's video. It's February 17th as of me recording this video. At this point, Minecraft 1.21 has probably been in development for roughly give or take 7 months now. Though we don't really know that for sure. These are just estimates after all. Now, most recent Minecraft updates have released in early June. So we probably have about 4 months left of development for this update, maybe a bit less or more. And that might sound like a lot of time, but there's a lot less time for new features to get added than there might seem. On March 22nd last year, Mojang released basically the last big content snapshot for the 1.20 update. This snapshot added the trail ruins, new pottery shirts, new armor trims, and even more. The thing is though, is that the only content that we got for the 1.20 update after that was the music disc, and basically nothing else. And so the concerning thing here is that March 22nd is only barely over a month from now, so this is very concerning for 1.21 because 1.21 could stop getting new content in just about a month's time. And that is indeed kind of scary to think about. I mean, currently the trial chambers are still unfinished, so 1.21 could end up being basically just the trial chambers at this rate. And possibly even more concerning is the fact that by this point last year we'd gotten almost all of the 1.20 content in snapshots. On February 16th last year we got quite possibly the biggest snapshot for the 1.20 update that included things like the Cherry Grove biome, the Sniffer, and the introduction of archaeology. So, I was kind of hoping for a big snapshot last week, but we didn't really get one, though we did get the new Boggs mob. In other words, if the schedule of last year is anything at all to go by, then we've basically gotten all of the 1.21 content and snapshots already. However, although this all does sound very concerning, the point that I actually want to make here is that just because that's how things went last year with the development schedule, that's not necessarily how things will go this year. The developers could still be working on some big new features that they just haven't released in snapshots yet. And I do wish that the developers communicated a bit better about this, because it is very worrying. I mean, I'm worried, and I certainly know that a lot of other people are as well. However, it's important not to lose hope and just keep an open mind in general. Hope for Minecraft 1.21 is far from lost. I mean, that's kind of the thing about snapshots, is that you basically never know what to expect. Any week could be a massive snapshot with a bunch of major new features. Though the thing is, is that we haven't had one quite like that this year yet. I mean, we've definitely had a few new 1.21 features in 2024 so far, but they've been spread out across multiple snapshots. And so it seems like Mojang is taking a bit of a different approach to snapshots than they did last year. For those of you that don't know, 1.21 snapshots were basically we'd get a few snapshots with little to no content, then we got a few major snapshots with a lot of content in them. So it would be a few weeks of basically no content, then one big snapshot, then a few weeks of no content, then another big snapshot, and so on. Meanwhile, for 1.21 snapshots, it seems like Mojang's just releasing basically one feature in each and every snapshot so far. That is, aside from the ones that were just bug fixes and gameplay tweaks. 
And what I want to bring up is that maybe they've been doing this to kind of build up to one big reveal. And that's a reveal that we could be seeing any week now. And so that's why I haven't lost hope for the 1.21 update yet. Because we really don't know what else is coming in the update as of right now. I mean, keep in mind that it is Minecraft's 15th anniversary. And that was specifically mentioned at Minecraft Live 2023 in regards to the update. And honestly, at this point Minecraft probably needs something big. And there's a good chance that Microsoft and Mojang are aware of that. But anyway, those are just my thoughts on this. I wanna know what you guys think. Are you still excited for 1.21? And just how much of it do you think we've actually seen so far? Because I'm curious to know your thoughts in the comments below. So that'll about do it for today's video. I always appreciate it if you like and subscribe. It means a lot more to me than you probably know. And now, goodbye.